Look, lyrically, I'm supposed to represent. So that's what I'm going to do in this video. It's the WC. And what you see on the screen is America's team taking a knee before the game. They don't like President Trump. And there's another bunch of teams that did that yesterday. Yesterday meaning Sunday, September 24th, 2017. I have to document it. I mean, I want to document it as the beginning of the end for the NFL, right? This is a fight that the NFL cannot win. Y'all know I'm super lyrical, man. This is not a this is not a fight that the NFL can win. All right? And the NBA best not even try it. They best not even try it. With LeBron James's hairline basically back to his damn neck, the NBA better not try it, bro. They better not try it. You know the same league that rested players during primetime games. You know the Golden State Warriors and the San Antonio Spurs in the middle of the damn season rested all of, basically everybody on the damn team during a primetime Saturday night game. And they think that the fans ain't fed up. And they dare, I, I'm telling you, NBA season is like, what, less than a month away. I, 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 I dare, I dare uh, LeBron James and the rest of the NBA. Golden State Warriors, whoever in the hell, I dare y'all to take a knee. Because I got a lot of subscriptions and, you know, seat tickets, all this stuff, to, you know, games, watch the Wizards games. I like that stuff on fire. I'm more I'm more big into the NBA than I am the NFL, but I'm outraged here too. Oh, y'all Cowboys fans, where y'all at? America's team. America's team took a knee before the game Monday Night Football against the Arizona Cardinals. They still America's team? All y'all Cowboys fans out there? They still America's team? Look, let me slow it down for y'all. I understand that y'all don't like Trump. I get it. I understand that y'all don't like that man. All right? But he is the 45th president of the United States of America, and that guy pulls out the cannon on anybody that gets in the way. Anybody can get it. And that's one thing that I kind of admire about him. Because, you know what I'm saying, you pull out the cannon on anybody and everything. How many people, like, how many people did he pull out the cannon on just over the weekend? I mean, at least at least a hundred, uh, at least a hundred million people. He pulled out the cannon. I mean, he pulled out a can. He pulled out the cannon on a whole ca country over the weekend, plus the NFL, whole sports league. Like that guy is a gangster. Whether I like President Trump or not, the guy's a gangster. Do I agree with his rhetoric saying that they SOBs and all this other stuff for wanting to take the knee? You know, no, I don't agree with the rhetoric. Of course, I don't. It's divisiveness. But at the end of the day, you don't disrespect that flag. You don't disrespect it, bruh. Men and women, the proud proud men and women of the U.S. military. I know people that have died for that damn flag. And y'all taking knees. Because he said that y'all should be fired for kneeling on a flag that y'all shouldn't even be kneeling on. You know those same men and women, those people in the military... Going overseas to protect y'all, y'all's right, or so-called freedom, because there ain't nothing free in this country, if y'all notice that. There's nothing free in this damn country. You have to be brave. People don't even know what the whole meaning of land of the free, home of the brave is, man, in this country. Ain't that sad? You have to be brave enough in order to be free. And there still isn't any rule. There's no such thing as free in this country. You have to work for everything that you get. Freedom ain't free. And the NFL is going to find that out. That y'all think that y'all free to kneel on the flag? There's people that's overseas that fought for your right to play football for a damn living. And you're going to take a knee on the flag. Think about how ridiculous that is. I, like I said, I dare LeBron in the NBA, Steph Curry in the Golden State Warriors. I dare y'all to take the knee at the, uh, uh, around Halloween. I dare y'all to do it. I dare y'all. And NBA's rating is going to go down too. And a lot of these sports, I'm going to tell you like this, a lot of this sports stuff is starting to go down either way. I mean, even without, you know, disrespect for the flag. You don't disrespect that flag, bro. You just can't do it. You can't do it in this country. This is a great country. 
even though that I understand, I understand the whole premise of it. You feel as though that black men or brown people, you know, social inequality, social injustice, being killed for no reason. No, 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 no. All right. Don't try to sell that narrative to people that that know what the hell is going on. All right. Black men in the black community are what? Uh, what? I'll make up a number so y'all can understand, but it will be somewhere closer to uh, the range. They're 500 times more likely to get shot by another black man than by a police officer. Don't sell me that narrative. I don't want to hear it. All right. I just don't want to hear it because I know it's not true. I know it's garbage. So you're kneeling down on the flag for a narrative that is just so far fetched to the point where you can't even build a reasonable argument over it. It's like they're trying to tell you that black lives matter. Why do people need to know that your life matters? We already know that your life matters. Every life matters. Everybody matters, man. If you're breathing, you matter. If you're walking, you matter. If you're thinking, you matter. And people are going to use their individual thoughts. They're going to use their individual monies or whatever, you know, individual banks bank accounts. All right. To stop paying the NFL and stop watching their product. All right. When you got America's team, so-called America's feet, where the Cowboys fans at, man? Like y'all should have already done commented before this video is already over, man. Where the Cowboys fans at? America's team took a knee on the flag. What y'all going to do? Y'all going to burn y'all stars and stripes? Huh? Got gold stars and blue stripes? Well, blue, blue stars and gold stripes? Y'all going to burn them? What's the next move, Cowboys fans? I wanted to wait until the I wanted to wait until the Cowboys did it. Because they're so-called America's team, right? Look, this is disgusting. This is disrespectful. They should stop doing it. And this is not a fight that the NFL or the NBA, MLB, NHL, any sports league can win against the fans. You pay your salary, shut up and play football. Shut up shut up and play basketball. And all y'all celebrities out there that's egging these assholes on, like I, I, look, I thought I wasn't going to cuss in this video. Stop it. Just stop it. This is not a fight that you can win. I know that y'all don't like Trump. That's fine. But don't disrespect the flag. It's the WC. And I'm out of here. Bye.